from her old spices and remedies meet in the heart of agriculture, Kingston, where politics rape the country and move somewhere else, Chicago. I am from starstruck mother who follows shark-like father and finally settles down somewhere where each generation tries to stick to old customs like burnt rice to pots and find and wash away from new city life. I was bred into a family of five, from two lovers that made four hellions and one significant other. I am from a misery meets serenity, balance. But balance was not in this household, it was anarchy where middle child learns from top two and teaches bottom two, but nothing was learned. Top two, since Sarah and Steven yell at bottom two, Noella Malik, for not listening to middle child, me. Since, since Sarah hates school, Steven has that job, college is probably the furthest thing from Noelle's mind, and Malik just thinks that the NBA is going to pluck him from a crowd of a million other guys, middle child is left to uphold mama's dream. Middle child that turns into middle finger when the dream fades into reality. Now labeled as black sheep, middle child strays away from his flock and goes to seek sanctuary in the new herds of the concrete jungle. Only to find one kind of people act like different species of nigger. He is then labeled misfit for being typically uncanny and not only he will always be a wannabe. Always missing that handful of something that gives him a maybe next time feeling. So he roams, wandering around observing all of the insiders in the natural habitat, Inglewood, but people spread their peacock feathers and show their true colors. He falls, realizing that he's stuck in between two places that doesn't want him. He looks up, hoping that that roll of thunder might reply after hearing his cry, but it doesn't. He's lost. It's how with no seat. He thinks it's over. No. Middle child says no. He has not come all this way to die between the rock and the hard place. Middle finger flips off the situation and misfit forces a way through it. Black sheep rips off a piece of his personality and identity, forcing his way through the situation. And instead of going back for that old piece, he searches for a new one. Thank you. Yeah!